Hello everybody and welcome back to Lightning Wing Productions. My name is Lightning and today I'll be your guide into the world of gaming. Today we're going to play some more Night in the Woods. Last time we discovered that it, 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 it has become Halloween and the Harvest Festival is happening. We found a tooth in a safe that we finally managed to get to because the father finally moved those boxes and we smashed up some light bulbs with Greg. Now we are going to jump into the game and see what Possum Springs is like on Halloween. I really should have saved this game for October. <laughs> Let's jump in. Oh yeah, by the way, we're Witch Dagger now. <coughs> Pretty good costume. Pretty good costume. Let's see... No dad, no mom. Oh, I can't... Hello? Hmm. They must already both be... They must already be out. See, there is nothing... Oh, harvest. There is nothing wrong with dressing up on Halloween, no matter how old you are. Last time... Last Halloween, I dressed up as Dr. Eggman. Show that costume. Okay, loud music. But yeah, show that costume. Dr. Eggman, Halloween 2017. I really should have saved this game for friggin' Halloween. It's spoopy! Oh, I can't, I can't jump at all. Let's do fortune telling. Dare you spin the Wheel of Destiny? Explain. None can explain the power of the wheel. Save that it can unknowable circular. Sorry. Save that it is an unknowable circular soothsayer. Oh snap! Is it gonna say a sooth? The sooth shall be said. <laughs> okay, I'm into this. Is your arm injured? It's a little sore lately, actually. I could tell. Let's see all. Your fortune is your future. A place you will soon be. Forever. Okay, that checks out. Your card says much. In your life are those who would harm you. But also those who will protect you. You shall know both in your time. So some people are cool, some people are assholes. Language! Sorry, this just seems like a random fact about life. The cards do not lie. The wheel that chooses the card is unknowable. So this is unknowable truth? You have le learned much, child. I should probably speak up a bit. <laughs> I'm 20. Well, that was interesting. May the wheel ever spin in your favor. All right then. <laughs> Fortunes are weird. At least we didn't have to pay anything. <coughs> Splash them. Hold up. Colleen, how do I get this... get into this thing? God damn it. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Welcome to Harvest Spectacular Water Balloon Toss. You know what to do. Or can figure it out pretty quick. Okay, let's go. Woo, you hit the spooky ghost. <laughs> I'm gonna haunt you for that. <laughs> I'm extremely cold and wet. Ah! <laughs> oh no, I'm dead again. <laughs> <laughs> I've melted. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> rattle, rattle, I'm a skeleton. Are you saying I'm gonna have a bad time? <laughs> this is fun. Hitting people with water balloons is always fun. sure was something. On behalf of Possum Springs Town Council, we urge you to support local business and enjoy our historic home. Possum Springs more li- Kathleen, no. More like Awesome Springs. Okay, we're done. What was my score? Was that number the timer? Because I don't think it- I think my score was actually 22 there. Oh, some people are actually in costume. This guy looks like he's a badass biker. Or is he just uh, another citizen of the town? Oh! There's actually people parading. Market house? I could go in here? Hey, hey! What you up to? Seriously? What? You got a problem with dressing up on Halloween? We're putting on this year's harvest pageant. Oh, right. Okay. Live from the old pickaxe. When's this thing supposed to start? Uh, ten minutes, I think. You think? Uh, this is a nightmare. Why did I ever agree to do this? Chamber of Commerce owes me big for this. Jeez, I hear ya. <coughs> what? Okay, so here's the thing. You won't have many lines. Wait. So May is in this? What? I've had like three no-shows. Why? Because this whole thing is stupid and nobody cares about it. Bay. Please, it's a fun part. Bay. Yeah? I will, like, totally save your ass. I might have memorized this from when I was a kid. Probably not. They rewrote it, like, six times in the past two years. <coughs> <coughs> to be spookier. So it's, like, 20% actual history now. And, like, 80% spooks. So it's, like, fake history now? It's, like, the bad remake. That doesn't respect the, the source material. Oh, I hate those! It starts off normal, but gets... Anyway, you got like five minutes to look at your lines. I can wing it. Mate, please don't wing it. Okay. Well, I hope this doesn't end the night early. Really? Oh. I didn't see you there. Be ye ghosts. Are ye here to hear? The tale of how Sp Possum Springs came to be? <laughs> I'm willing to bet that those five people in the crowd are the only five people who care about this thing. <laughs> Through the mists of time, I see. Wary fur trappers from 1793. Okay, this is weird because the citizens are technically animal and they're covered in fur, too. Brother John! Yes, Brother Steven. From this vantage point, I do spy a deep hollow. And within, a great dead tree. So wait, is this Sleepy Hollow now? Because I've seen that movie. Yeah, <laughs> Excuse me, sorry for that. And besides, with a witch, a spring. Blessed are we, Brother Stephen, for truly my throat is parched from these long and ard ard arduous, hope I'm saying that right, travels. And care, bitch, you did not just sigh at me. <laughs> and carrying these 300 beaver pelts, that's a fucking lot, holy shit. Let us make haste, oh excellent brother.
Ho, travelers! Spare a crust of bread for a needy woman. I think that feels like the, the right one. <laughs> Haggard witch. Horrible to look upon. Cruel young men. Ye did not even offer one of thy three hundred fine beaver pelts to warm my ancient bones. I shall curse ye in thee, or thou art rude and un... Yeah, this, this, I think this is the right one. Because this has, like... Naughty boy in it, and that's more like modern term. I shall curse ye and thee. And this very night ye shall perish. <laughs> I am fearful. Steady, brother Stephen. I did not venture out into these hills to joust words with a hell hag. <laughs> May's getting into this. I was born among these trees. Neath, neath a harvest moon. And ye shall die under that moon. Brother John, I am frightened. Faith, Brother Stephen. Art thou so easily shaken by the rambling of an old crone? Come, help carry, help me carry these 300 beaver pelts. But little did anyone know that the old witch did not curse in vain. <laughs> I hope we didn't screw that up. I feel like we picked the right words for that. Oh, I thought that was it. Is this a new scene? Help, help. Who will help a poor traveler? Oh, it's Greg. Sweet. Uh, um, uh, by the moon and stars above us, sir. I beseech thee. What is thy trouble? You're in this? Yep. Ah! Witch! Yep. I swear thee, friend, that this di very day, this horrifying crone did curse my brother and I to die. The wounds! The wounds? What? Okay. We camped by this very spring beneath the dead tree, and even now his body lieth upon the earth, lifeless as a pile of three hundred beaver pelts. Oh, it chilleth the heart. <laughs> I did curse the spring. A curse upon rude young men. Um. I don't know what the right one is. A curse upon rude young men. I did curse this. You know, I'm going to say it's the spring. That any man who drinketh from it shall perish. <laughs> ah, I am slain. I join thee now, brother Stephen. Oh, jeez. <laughs> he actually fell. Wow. I am also undone, for I have drinketh of the water. Don't leave me here, Greg. Bye. And yet, even there... The curse's lust for blood would not be seated. Okay, is that it or are we just getting another scene now? Okay, next scene, I guess. Gaze upon them. Gaze upon these spirits. Brother, we are now ghosts. Ah! I am tormented by the accusing glare. Hold up a sec. Does is this connected to our dreams? Of 300 ghostly beavers. It would seem that all who die here are cursed to never leave. Doth that witch not know what she hath done? Uh, um, crap. Did she, did May really forget her line? Four. For each man is determined on his path. I'll, I'll say that. And each path leads only to his end. Okay. 
and yet each path may lead to places unknown. You! From the bus... Oh, from the bus station. Young witch, it is I, the god of the forest. I just didn't expect you to... Ain't that the way? So, witch, thou hast tarried too long in this world. I banish thee to wander in the night through the stranger places. I... What? Oh, God. How did you know? Young witch, let me speak wisdom to you. We begin and we end at night in the woods. Roll credits! But that is not the whole of the story. This is your line. Okay. Forest God, thou hast no power here. <laughs> Even now, thy end beginneth. Ack! My infernal powers! Shh, young witch. Even now, the world you know endeth. And who can say what lieth in the world to come? Wow. Uh, ooh, pardon me, folks. <laughs> Beware as you go, for there are ghosts. Ooh. Take care. Is that it? I want to explore. I really hope this doesn't mean we can't explore the rest of Possum Springs like this. And so was founded then this festival. On Halloween, we shall celebrate the dying of the, of the year and the founding of Possum Springs. I, Mayor Ghost, decree it. Mayor Ghost, the beaver population suffered a decline, and now our biggest exports are, are corn and pumpkins. We used to be the county seat. Uh... Actually, the myth of the Wicked Witch. It's a production of a century's crew. And that's our show. Be careful as you leave here, for who knows what may lurk in the darkness. Also, be sure to pick up a flyer on your way out from the Possum Springs Chamber of Commerce. Support your spooky local businesses! I stand by what I said. I believe those are the only five people to care about this stupid thing. <coughs> Hopefully that was it. And I hope we did not fuck that up. Jeez, thanks guys. I am never doing that again. So what are we doing now? Well, I am going home. Angus is making dinner and we're watching horror movies. Can I come? It's more a date thing. Oh. Okay then. <laughs> what are you doing, bae? Chamber of Commerce folks are going to the buffet out, out by Ham Panther. Kind of have to go. Business stuff. I hate this. But you're good at it. Both of those things can be true. Can I come? Nope. Okay, well. Good night. Good night. Well, I guess we're all by ourselves and we can explore more. This is garbage. Wait... Does this have any relation to- Um! What the- Okay! Oh my god! Hey! Anyone! Shit! Oh, we're going after him! Shit just got real, folks! I'm not controlling anything. Where the hell did he go? Shit. Okay, now I'm in control. Dude. May, go home. There's a guy up there on the hill. He stole some kid. He looked like a ghost. A ghost, huh? Or something like that. Mate, you shouldn't be out here doing whatever it is you're doing. No, no, so 
No, no one should be out here. But there's this guy. I'll drive you home, May. No! May, now. What the? Okay, I guess we're going to the left then. Is this a nightmare sequence? I'm assuming Aunt Mall Cop took us home and now we're dreaming again. I'm expecting like a jump scare at any second. A box? Um... Okay, this is getting spoopy. Part 3, The Long Fall. Achievement unlocked. What? Okay, so that was different. Okay, different music for waking up. Um, okay. Well, at least we got a silhouette of this person. They're definitely tall. They can't be a gator because no alligator muzzle. <clears throat> Let's talk to our friends on the computer. Hey, May. Thanks for so much for your help last night. Woke up and realized that I completely imposed in a big way. Thank you. I really appreciate it. I'll be at work cleaning up after last night if you want to say hello. Hey, dude. Sorry I couldn't hang out last night. Angus says he's sorry, too. Band practice today because I'm in charge and I say so. Off to work. Bye. <laughs> Sharkle. Okay. So, to recap. We tried to enjoy Halloween. I guess I went to the pickaxe too early and didn't explore a little more. Oh, well. Like I said, I'm playing this game more than once, because different scenarios and choices and whatever. And we saw someone get legit kidnapped! So, we got a little time here. Let's see what's going on. Hey, hun. Yeah? Come say hello, why don't you? Yeah, let's see if we... Are we gonna tell mom what we saw? <coughs> hey, hun. Hey, mom. You look really tired. So do you. Also, I had a spl also I have a splitting headache. Well, the weather seems to agree with you. Gray and drizzly. I could go for that today. Are we not going to tell about what we saw? Hey, hun. Yeah. Sorry about yesterday. Me too. I said some stuff. I didn't really mean it. Well, whether you meant it or not, that isn't how we should communicate. I don't want us talk. I don't want us to stop talking. I just don't want a repeat of a few years ago. What happened a few years ago? I'm really sorry, Mom. About all of it. Hey, May. You okay? I'm fine. Guess I'm stressed, too. Saw some weird stuff last night. Or I think I did. Want to talk about it? Yes. Ah, oh, come on. Later. I'm still putting it together. Can we talk about school? Also later. Okay, then. I guess we're going out. I want to know what the hell that happened. Like, did Officer Mall Cop just knock us out and bring us home because we refused? Or is Mage still trying to figure it out, simply? How's it going, Slummers? Uh, Selmers, how was your Halloween? Weird. Went to Harvest. Saw some messed up shit that I think was real. Then I had a really bad nightmare. Cool. I stayed and ate candy and watched TV. Halloween episodes were on. Well, I was out living a Halloween episode, okay? Whoa. Yep. Want to hear a new poem? Mm, I'll pass. Cool. 
Okay. So, we basically witnessed the kidnapping. And we don't know what the hell happened. Other than someone got nabbed. You know what? I gotta go to the pickaxe and pick up that kid's phone, because that was dropped. Maybe if I find that... You know what? First, let me grab a pretzel for the rats. If I could find that phone that was obviously dropped on the ground, then that's evidence. I bet some rat babies would love a delicious pretzel. This is unfairly easy now. <coughs> oh, hello, May. Um, do I know you? I do not know if you remember me, Miss Rosa. Um, I knew your grandfather. I visited you the day after you were born. You were so small. Rosa. Is he mistaking May for her mother? I guess some things don't change, eh? How did you know Granddad? I'm here most days. Why don't you stop by sometime? And I'll tell you all about him. Things you might not know. Alright, you've got my interest. Sweet, curious child. Okay. This is part of the reason why I intend on playing this game twice. Because there are things I'm just missing. I'm not checking everything like an OCD person that I normally am. Okay, uh, oh yeah, that's gone. Now I can see more of the poster, I guess. More like awesome. Yeah, wait. Good job having a a friggin' graveyard in the flyer. Good job. Oh shoot, I did not check the church at all yesterday. Damn. See, I need to check things more often. This is... I am definitely replaying this game to get the better, best, or true ending. Whatever. Hey, Mom, want to tell me how you're teleporting? Hey, hey, church mom. Hey, heathen daughter. <laughs> oh, I'll make it there in some... I'll make it in here someday. But come on, seriously. No one likes getting up on Sunday. I find it very en enrich enriching. Your father does too. Mostly. But he attends, and that's important. And he knows it means a lot to me. Alright, well, guilt trip thoroughly... Whatever, I missed the word. You do work for the church. That's not what faith is like, hon. There's more grace than condem condemnation. Geez, some of these words I have never heard before. Kinda, whatever. Alright, I'm out. See you later, sweetie. Okay. What is the point of this area? Are we ever going to get a chance to go here? I feel like we are. <coughs> okay. I'm actually going to cut the video here because I have hit the half hour mark and I don't want to make the video longer than necessary. So to recap, we explored Possum Springs for a bit, then explored it on Halloween night, I inadvertently missed, possibly missed some things because I went right to the pickaxe and forgot about that pageant and we became part of it. We had to save Bay's ass because there was like two no-shows or three no-shows or whatever. And we witnessed a freaking kidnapping in this game. Holy crap. So... And then we had a weird nightmare that wasn't even really nightmarish. It was just creepy vibes and whatever. So, what we're gonna do next time is we're gonna talk to Pastor K first, and then we're gonna hunt down that cell phone, because I specifically saw that kid that got kidnapped drop his phone. That is evidence! Alright. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button. If you want to say something, leave a comment down below. And if you want to 
be sure to stay tuned for more videos by me, then hit the subscribe button, and make sure you ring that bell, because if you don't, YouTube's not gonna tell you when I upload shit. I am Lightning of Lightning Wing Productions, and I will see you all in the next video. Keep gaming, everybody! Yeah, that's still creepy.